if you apply technology properly, it is a great equalizer. Mm. It has a real opportunity to uh, bring in the opportunity to the, to the ordinary man, to the fisherman in Nigeria, or to, uh, to an um, agricultural producer in the rice fields in Vietnam, um, to give them an opportunity to do business better. Um, uh, so it levels off the playing field if we apply uh, the technology properly. So both economic growth, which helps us to be prosperous and to alleviate property as well as to, uh, to equalize. <clears throat> Technology created the problem of global climate change, and I'd be interested in hearing your views about how it can help fix the mess we're in. Yeah, I don't think technology created the mess. <laughs> um, what happened was that technology provided the um, opportunity to generate growth through uh, using quite a lot of energy. And how we generate the energy, how efficiently we use the energy, uh, has, has actually the biggest single bearing uh, to uh, what climate change really means. Can we mitigate it, or is it one of the major problems ahead of us in the next uh, decades? Um, so it's all about how we use technology. Mm. And uh, we just have to uh, saddle the technology to the best possible use also um, in, in this respect. If you look at Tim Berners-Lee's World Wide Web, mm. what it means is that it has brought this fantastic uh, tool, internet, mm. uh, into life in a, uh, in a very user-friendly, easy to use way. And uh, th this is par excellence, an example mm. of what technology can do when it's, an, when, when, when it's a real equalizer because uh, the ease of use allows um, uh, not only for scientists to access information and, um, and, and uh, have that available, but also for every man, whether, whether it's a youngster mm. in early teens or whether, um, whether it's um, um, a, a, a businessman in, uh, in Africa, Asia, in a developing world, uh, you know, look, looking at making an impact. So, you can, with, uh, you can y use the web-based uh, applications and do, do wonderful things. Um, uh, and uh, in this respect, I think uh, um, the Millennium Prize actually got a real breakthrough in the minds of a lot of people mm -hmm. because uh, it, was, it was a very good start to brand the prize, if you want, mm -hmm. uh, to, to, give a, to give a meaning to the prize, because it's, it's not pure research, it's, mm -hmm. it's a great innovation. Um, if we then look at uh, Suchi Nakamura's um, uh, lighting uh, application, a LED um, innovation, or a number of innovations, mm -hmm. in fact, there. So, it's all about efficient use of energy mm. um, and uh, how we bring inexpensive application which uses efficiently the, uh, uh, the finite energy resources that we have mm -hmm. uh, on the globe. Um, and, uh, and in this respect, um, I think it, uh, it hit the chord as well in the minds of a lot of people.